All right, Spirit, what do we have for Leo Collective? We got the Ten of Swords reversed. What else do we have for Leo Collective, Spirit? We got the Nine of Cups, but it's reversed. That's too many cards. We need one more card, Spirit. Clear intuitive messages, please. Okay, this stands out. We got the Five of Wands. Okay. So, Leo, I feel like there could be somebody that is having a hard time letting go of some form of betrayal, whether this is you or whether this is the other person. But I am getting this energy. It is leaving somebody quite unhappy. Somebody is definitely not satisfied about this outcome. We got the Ten of Swords reversed in the Nine of Cups. And whoever this is that may be stuck in their head about what was done to them, I feel like they they struggle to, you know, basically be okay with being alone. You see what I'm saying? Or they struggle with being okay um, basically about the situation, like letting it go. You know what I'm saying? This is somebody struggling to let it go, basically, um, with this five of wands right here. And um, maybe you realize, Leo, that if this is you, maybe you realize that your person may have other people competing. You see what I'm saying? So we're going to we're gonna dive a little bit deeper in the situation and see what else is taking place. I don't know. What, I feel like I'm... One second. This light is, is dumb. All right, let's clarify. Okay, we got the higher fit, but it's reversed. Some of y'all, there may be a separation or it could be a breakup of a relationship with the Hierophant. Some of y'all could be dealing with an earth sign or a water sign. I'm also seeing air and fire. I think Hierophant, is that Taurus? I think that's Taurus energy. But somebody could have Taurus in their chart. But we got the Five of Pentacles reversed. I don't know why my light be looking so dark. I gotta fix it. I'm going to take this one because it's upright. We got the Nine of Swords. But it's reversed. So, yeah, I strongly feel like mentally somebody in their head about a breakup. It's either that this person broke it off with you, Leo, this relationship with you, or that y'all could still be together. But maybe y'all could be separated because we do got the higher fit reversed right here. And like I said, it's leaving somebody unhappy, but it is saying that they will eventually overcome this. Some of you guys, this person may pop back up after you, you know, get over whatever it is that has happened to you um, that led up to some form of betrayal with this person, Leo. But I am getting this energy where, where even though this person may have walked away from you, Leo, I am seeing eventually you will get over this or you will get over, you no, know, you will get over of the thought of them leaving um, in a situation or one or the other. Um, and I'm seeing that some of y'all's person could be coming back. So it's like I'm seeing, I'm seeing three different energies, to be honest. Some of you guys, I, I strongly get, we're going to say most of y'all. Most of y'all's person going to come back because we do got the five of pentacles. But I feel like it's only after you recover from some form of um, betrayal. You see what I'm saying? But, yeah, I, I, do, I do feel that way. But I am getting this energy where it's like when you get over this person, Leo, like, you're not going to be feeling the same way anymore. I feel like whatever you had going on in your mind, Leo, in regards to this person, I feel like you're going to basically, I'm just getting this energy, Leo, where y'all going to be, y'all going to get your mind back. Because I'm, I'm going to be honest, some of y'all could be like a little bit mentally messed up a little bit over this. You know what I'm saying? I just feel like sometimes y'all reminisce about what they have done to you. Maybe you feel traumatized. Some of y'all was feeling very much traumatized. Or maybe you could be in this energy right now. But it's saying, Leo, that... It will get better mentally. It definitely will get better. We got the nine of swords reversed because I just feel like a lot of y'all have spent a lot of sleepless nights, you know, just up at night thinking about the betrayal that this person has put you through. You know what I'm saying? Because some of y'all, I strongly feel like your person could be having you in comp competition with somebody else because we got the five of wands right here. But maybe you was you were struggling to get this person's attention, Leo. 
but it's like eventually you're gonna bury that in the back of your mind some of y'all gonna end up burying it with that whatever this person did to you leo you will bury it in the back of your mind you will get over it so basically it's saying that whatever betrayal that they have done to you however you was feeling is not gonna last forever leo it's saying basically this burden that you is feeling right now is not going to last forever you will get over this person no matter how long it takes you will get over this person leo what else do we have spirit in this situation uh oh don't it always happen like this we got the we got the knight of cups so dang leo so it's saying that when you get to a point leo that you completely got over this person you got over the betrayal that they have put you through it's like when you finally get that energy like far as them being irrelevant I feel like that's when this person going to come back. Some of you guys, this person could be coming back with a gift, maybe some flowers or something tangible. If not, they could be coming back with some form of explanation. All right, what else, Spirit? It always happens like that. The minute you let go completely, they come back all the time. It's like so it's like when you mind your business, that's when they come back. But the love has lost. Some of y'all, by the time this person come back, you may not feel the same way anymore. We got the Ace of Cups reversed. Some of y'all ain't going to feel the same way anymore because you have recovered from that loss of them walking away from you, Leo. You have healed from that loss of them walking away. Even if you're not emotionally healed, Leo, basically, in the back of your mind, you, you got this person where you need them to be. You know what I'm saying? And I just felt like, it is more of you letting go mentally of, I would say, the trauma. Basically, the thought of them leaving you for good. That's that's the energy. Like, you're not afraid to walk away from them. That's the energy that I'm picking up on that I'm trying to say, right? It's like you're, you're not afraid to walk away from them. Yes, before you was afraid of walking away from this person and them, you know, hurt about them leaving you out in the cold for somebody else, right? You're going to get to the point where you just don't give a F. You see what I'm saying? But I am getting that energy. This person going to come back with some form of explanation, maybe a gift, maybe an apology, right? But like I said, you may not feel the same way about them like you used to anymore, Leo, because you have recovered from the thought of them, you know, losing, of losing them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you may have been afraid to leave them before or you was afraid of them leaving you before, but now, mm-mm. Or this could be energy that's coming. Because some of y'all still could be in this energy where you could be afraid of this person leaving you. But listen, you will overcome this. It keeps saying in the back of my mind, you will overcome the thought of, you know, losing losing this person and them leaving you behind. But we got the moon card right here. So, like I said, some of you guys may end up rejecting this person. Some of you guys. Some of you guys fell in love with this person by the time this person come back. You know, you may reject this person. And like I said, the love may just pretty much be lost by the time this person, you know, come back. And you know what's crazy? Your person still keeping some things from you when they come back because we got the moon card. I strongly feel that. Some of y'all still is in love with this person by the time they come back. But you may not want this person to know that. You know what I'm saying? Maybe you playing it cool. Maybe you just don't want them to know that, you know that how, how deeply you feel for them but most of y'all are not getting that you gonna end up falling out of love with this person and by the time by the time this person come back leo your person gonna want you by, by the time this person come back i, I say your person by the time this person come back you gonna fall out of love with this person but i'm gonna have to clarify this moon card because what is so secret what is so secret i i really want to know what is the secret for real because is it the simple fact that this person has a lot of deep feelings for you more than you know? Or it's the simple fact that this person is keeping things, some things from you, basically. But we're going to clarify that moon card because I really want to know what is so secret. What is such a secret? We need to clarify the moon cards, please. Wow. The Empress Reverse. The secret is that the other person walked away from them because we got the empress reversed that's the secret the secret is the other person walked away from them or your person walked away 
from them. But just know the third party is going to be gone by the time this person come back to you. They may not tell you this, Leo. They may not tell you this. Now, this is getting crazy. They may not tell you that the other person is gone or the other person left them. Hmm. Wow. We got the nine of pentacles reversed. Some of y'all, your person got that person pregnant and they walked away from them. I'm going to be honest with y'all. I'm strongly getting that for somebody. Somebody got pregnant in the background. Some of y'all could be the third party. I am getting that also for some of y'all. Somebody got pregnant and they walked away. And that's when they swing back to you. Especially if you the one Leo that will eventually get over this person after being afraid of them leaving you. Your person coming back because they got the other person pregnant, Leo. And I don't think that's what they wanted. So they end up walking away and coming back to you, Leo. I am getting that. Your person is definitely going to be hanging on to you. They're not uh, they're not uh, they're not happy about this at all. Because now they got money coming out their pocket. You see what I'm saying with this nine of pentacles, but it is saying that that person got the third party pregnant and that could be the reason why your person is coming back to you. It's like they trying to like hide, you know what I'm saying? Hide the simple fact that you know they got this other person pregnant and make it seem like when they come back that you know they all in love with you, they missed you. That's BS. That's BS. Some of y'all I feel like your person never really was emotionally involved. I'm just spilling all the tea. But listen, your person was never really emotionally involved with neither one of y'all. And for two, I just felt like your person, once again, got the other person pregnant and walked away, Leo. And now they want to save face and hold on to you. Now they want to save face and hold on to you. That's exactly what I'm seeing, Leo, with this nine of pentacles right here. We're just getting deep. I got the chills. <laughs> I got the chills. We got the Queen of Swords right here. And um, maybe they could be telling you the truth. Some of you guys, this person could be telling you the truth. Or this is you flat out telling them how you feel. You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like this is you. Yeah, they're trying to hold on to you, Leo, with the Nine of Pentacles reversed. But you could be flat out telling this person how you feel or what it is or what it ain't going to be. Whatever you say to them. You say something truthful to them, Leo. Right? And it, I feel like it has something to do with them leaving you for that other person. You see what I'm saying? And now your guard is up. We got the nine of wands right here. Y'all protecting yourself right now. And you know what's crazy? Because your person is like literally holding on to you. And some of y'all's person got other people lined up. Some of y'all, some of y'all, this is y'all energy where y'all got other people in the background lined up. I don't know who this is. But somebody got other people lined up in the background, even though this person holding on to this one wand, which is you, Leo. But I am, not, of course, not everybody. But I am getting this energy, Leo, where y'all are pretty much protecting yourself from this person because maybe you know that this person got other people lined up. You see what I'm saying? Because like I said, some of y'all's person had you in competition, even if they was shacked up with another person which is the person that they may have got pregnant and ran back to you, your person probably still had HOEs in the background. I'm strongly getting that with these two cards. So, you know what I'm saying? Yes, they may seem like they picked a, a certain individual or they were just dealing with that one individual or whatever, but deep down inside, your person must be a player, right? Your person is an HOE, or this could be your energy. Maybe you as a player, but I'm sorry if I'm spilling the tea, but <laughs> it is what it is. But I am getting that energy where... Y'all on guard by the time this person come back. Y'all done feel out of love. Y'all on guard, Leo. And even if you still in love with this person, you not allowing it to be known because you just now got to a space where you are fine without them. You see what I'm saying? You don't want to go back to that mental imprisonment about what they have done to you, Leo, because it, it basically traumatized you, Leo. You know what I'm saying? And maybe you just now getting over, you know, this situation about what they have done. It's like you buried it in the back of your mind. You see what I'm saying? If not, you will get to that energy, Leo. Some of y'all still could be upset in fear of the thought of losing this person. But just know they coming back. Some of y'all know this person coming back. But I am getting that energy where y'all going to be on guard. Y'all feel like y'all need to protect yourself with this person because maybe you just felt like the whole situation with this person is just exhausting. You know what I'm saying? 
And um, I am getting that energy. I really do feel that way. But let's dive a little bit deeper in this situation. Wow. Some of y'all probably could be dealing with a Virgo. I said a, um, a earth sign. It could be Virgo, Taurus. It can be air, water. I'm seeing Libra, Taurus again. Or you could have these placements in your chart. But somebody is not going to be happy. Somebody ain't going to be happy. You know what? I'm going to pull one of these cards. I'm going to pull one of these cards. I surely feel like, Leo, your person is trying to save face by running back to you because they got the other person pregnant. And that's not what they really wanted. But like I said, them not realizing you have already, you know, gained to be confident enough to be fine without them. You will get to that place. If you ain't in that place right now, Leo, and you still could be afraid of losing them, just know they're coming back and they ain't about nothing. They ain't. But that's good by the time they do come back that you may not feel the same way about them anymore because they got somebody else pregnant in the background, right? Like, where they do that at? Look, this was a blessing in disguise, Spirit is saying. This is definitely a, a blessing. Spirit is trying to protect you, Leo. That's why it happened how it happened. Them getting another person pregnant. You know, they were supposed they supposed to stay gone. Some of you guys, I am getting that energy. They're supposed to stay gone because them doing that. And it, it, it was a blessing. It's a blessing that they have done that, Leo, because I just feel like y'all need to protect yourself. Spirit is protecting you, trying to protect you by any means necessary, like literally. But y'all need to take your power back, Leo. We got empowerment right here. Y'all need to protect yourself because that's what Spirit is trying to do and take your back, power back. But listen, some of y'all, this person may try to come in and control this whole situation, Leo. Um, but... It's because of, like I said, what's going on in the background where they just left. But I am seeing y'all going to be doing very much, you know, well for yourself by the time this person come back. Some of y'all could be supervisors or managers at a job. I am getting that. Some of y'all could be um, business owners. I am getting that energy. But your person still keeping secrets, Leo, with that moon behind that lady. Your person still keeping secrets, Leo. I'm also getting this energy. Um, if this is a woman... That's coming back. I feel like if you're dealing with a woman, same sex, it can be same sex or it can be the opposite, right? Your person could be pregnant by another person and they're coming back. So y'all be careful with this energy because somebody is either going to try to pin the baby on you. If you a man watching this and you was dealing with this woman. Or if this is a man that's coming back, Leo, and you was the woman that you was, you was dealing with, they have a baby in the background. Y'all take what applies. But... I'm going to go ahead and end it right here. If, if it resonates, don't forget to like and subscribe, and y'all take care.